right? Today, I'm going to show you how to save 24 cents on a bulk candy vending machine using only a penny and tape. Alright, this is a pre-made penny and tape, as I call it. And, um, so yeah, I'm going to show you how to make it, um, step by step. Well, there's really just like one step to it, but, alright. So you want to take your tape, about, not too short, but about this long. And then what you want to do, is you want to take your penny, okay? And you're going to just wrap it in the tape. Or wrap the tape over the penny. Um, and you want to keep doing it to where it'll be um, thick enough to um, not fall down in the slot like a regular penny and not give you your candy, which I'll show you in a minute. You want to make it to where it's nice and straight, which I'm not able to do, but you just want to make it straight. And then you just want to keep doing it and leave a little bit off. I don't know why, but usually it doesn't work if you don't leave any off. So, now you made it. Now I'm going to show you how it works. Alright, guys. There's some M&Ms in there. As you can see, there's nothing in there. So, this is a regular penny. Put in the slot. Follows down in the coin box and doesn't give you your candy. Now, this is the, um... Hang on, let me let's, um, put every... Put all the other ones on the floor. And, um, what you want to do... Let's take the one you just made, and you want to move it around a bit, but you want to make sure that the tape is actually wanting to face you. The sticky end is wanting to face you. I don't know why, but that's just the way it works with it. You want to make sure it's pushed out in there, and um, to where where the um, knob will turn, you want um, there, um, closer to that. On my, in my case, it's more to the right. So you want to turn it now. And as you can see, it didn't work this time. So like I said, you want to do some tinkering with it. I'm not perfect at it either. They just want to do some tinkering with it. And there you go. Your penny. It took your penny. But, you know. Saved about 24 cents on candy. I said, why well, I said about, because it was the tape that you had to pay for also. But yeah. Show you again with this one. You want to make sure the stick in, like I said, is facing you. And you want to make sure... Where the knob turns, it's closest to it. Which, in my case, it's on the right. And, turn it. And you get, say, about 24 cents, like I said. And there you go. There's your m &M. And if you were wondering, with the quarter, if you're put tape over a quarter and see if maybe, oh, it'll, it won't, it won't, um, it'll, it'll just get, um, stay in there, won't, like, take away my quarter. It won't do that, it'll just jam the machine. So that's it.